Hey there, everybody. Welcome back to another segment of MJOV's Quick Tips and Tricks. Uh, we're going to be talking about the practice range today as well as spell combinations. So let's jump right into it. Starting with the basics, we have a basic spell, Echo. People have trouble with Echo because it has a high cooldown if you miss your shots. This can be increased in speed by pairing it with Cyclone. But to make it even better to make sure you're not missing any shots at all, do a vacuum, make sure you suck yourself into the vacuum, and then you just hit your Echo and Cyclone back and forth so you have a really fast shooting machine gun, as we'll call it. Up next on the vacuum combos, we have what I call Pet Party. Start with the Frog of Life to bait your opponents into healing. Use a vacuum to suck the frog into your opponent, and a Pet Rock to increase the push, making them slide aimlessly and uncontrollably. Next, let's talk about my favorite melee spell, Geyser. Geyser pairs well with a lot of spells because it lifts opponents in the air, increasing their ability to be blasted far and away. Less friction, more speed. I like to pair Geyser with a water cannon spin, certain slower casting spells, or as many people have seen, Tovine. Geyser isn't the only spell that pairs well with Tovine. Though less consistent than Geyser, Push will also knock enemies quite a distance. But I'd say Relapse has some of the best combo potential with Tovine, since it'll guarantee damage from returning back to the position, and when they return back to that position, you're able to combo with another spell hit. I think Tovine is underrated for how much combo potential it has. Check out this Vanguard Tovine combo. I like to call Double-Edged Shield. Moving on to some Flame Leash combos. You may already know the Flash Flood combo with Flame Leash, but you could also use a Rock Wall to block off the player before he reaches you to increase the amount of distance shot. Also, if you use a Bull Rush in a different direction from where you're Flame Leashing to or from, then you're able to launch them even further outside of the map. Thanks to the practice range, we can create monsters like this five-piece titanic combo I came up with, and more. <laughs> Thanks to Chad and Brett, there's already plenty of combos written into the practice range for you to try right now. So, hop into the practice range, show me what you can do, or Drop your potential combos in the comments, and I'll try them out and let you know how it goes. That's going to be it for now, though. I'll catch you guys next time for the next Quick Tips and Tricks video. See you guys later.